This is Sarah Lowe and I'm going to show you how to save and export your iMovie. When you're done, you're going to go to the top left corner and hit done. You next want to make sure you name your movie. So I just tapped on the name and now I'm going to be able to replace that with either your name or you could do it as the project title, uh, whatever you think your teacher would like best. Next, I'm going to hit this little arrow in the middle. And when I click on this arrow, it gives me lots of versions of what I can do. I can airdrop it. I can um, save the video. What I always tell my students, uh, you need to make sure that you put it in your iMovie theater. And by exporting the movie to your iMovie theater, that means that it's putting it into the MP4 version. And that's a version that your teacher will easily be able to open, you will easily be able to open on your iPad or any other device, whether it's a Mac or a PC. So first put it into your theater, and then we're gonna go through that same process by hitting the Shero, and we are going to take it and put it into Google Drive. If you have it in Google Drive, then again, that's something you're gonna be able to access very easily on any device. So now that I'm here in my theater, I can click on my final version and hit that share button once more. And now I'm going to put it in my drive. Um, sometimes it puts a, a crazy file name. So once you get into your drive, uh, you can rename it. Uh, now I've clicked into my drive and you can put it in a specific folder to stay organized. Um, so I'm going to put it in my app folder and I'm going to save here and click upload. You have to make sure that you click save here and upload otherwise it will not actually upload to your Google Drive. So by the time that that's done I'd be able to go into my drive and then share it with my teacher. Alright, good luck.